By 2025 across Europe, 10 million tonnes of recycled plastics will be used in new plastic products. That's the pledge the European Commission has made. But in order to achieve that pledge, an extra 6 million tonnes of recyclable plastic content needs to be processed every year. At Atero, we're already expanding our recycling capacity by investing in our post-separation and sorting capabilities. This leads to different material streams and ultimately increases the amount of plastics ready for further recycling. Of these additional streams, post-consumer plastic film is the most challenging to recycle. It's often dirty and therefore more difficult to process into new. However, through innovation, including the use of renewable energy only and the reuse of water from our own plants, this can now be done in Atero's brand new polymer recycling plant in Weister. Transforming film waste into new plastic regranulate is done in just eight steps. First, bales of plastic film and bags are shredded. From there, Unwanted materials are sorted and separated using a near-infrared technique. The remaining plastic is then washed with cold water and shredded further into smaller flakes. Step four is the most important step of the process. Small specks of dirt cause big problems when blowing new plastic film material. In order to avoid any potential contamination, these flakes are washed with soap and hot water removing any further impurities. The flakes are then dried and temporarily stored before being melted, filtered and cut to regranulate. Finally, each batch is labelled so origin can be retraced. And that's it. The regranulate is ready for transportation to producers of new plastic products. With the new polymer recycling plant, Atero is committed to the European Committee's pledge. We're doing our part, recycling 24,000 tonnes of post-consumer plastic film into a high-quality regranulate, ready to be reused in Europe. How will you help?